y'all Irix guy here and I wanted to talk about something actually a lot of my viewers have asked how do you film steady video with the DJI Phantom 3 now this is this uh, same technique is also applicable to the uh, to the Phantom 2 and the Phantom 1 and quite possibly other drones as well uh, now you can see it's very windy here you can probably hear a lot of wind whipping around on my on my microphone I'm on the top of, uh, of the island of uh, St. Kitts see back there there's Nevis uh, which is another island but when you're flying in uh, when you're flying in windy conditions something you always want to keep in mind and this this isn't just wind but it's flying in general even on a perfectly calm day uh, the first thing you're going to want to do is adjust your gimbal and I've got a video on that how to smooth uh, how to uh, how to change the gimbal wheel speed for the Phantom 3 check the link within this video's description you can find that on 400 or below.com website I step you through it Basically what that does by default, when you gimbal up and gimbal down with the camera, it's a very rapid movement. And you know if you're filming a video with a camcorder or whatever, if you're moving around real rapidly, it doesn't look good. But if you got those really slow and controlled movements, it's more cinematic. So that's step one, you need to, you need to set your gimbal wheel speed. Uh, step two is obviously, you know, trying to fly, even though the Phantom does a really good job compensating for wind, try to fly when it's not too windy and it'll make uh, it'll make it just a better watchable experience for the for the viewer and don't don't fly rapidly a lot of mis a mistake that a lot of people make is that they uh, they fly really fast and they try to uh, try to make uh, rapid movements when you're filming video you want to fly really slow and while you're flying and you'll notice a lot of my videos check you know check the link within this video's description 400 or below got a ton of Phantom 3 videos and you'll see a lot of them where I'm flying and then concurrently while I'm going forward or backwards or maybe to the left I'm panning the camera down or panning the camera up and that's what gives it a really cool effect but the thing is keep in mind that when you originally film the video if you're going if you're flying at a slower speed it's going to be more advantageous because if you're flying at a slower speed it's going to look smoother and then if you want to speed it up what you can always do you can retime the video within uh, within your post-production so you could speed it up you know say you want to make the phantom look like it's flying faster you know you can go in post-production retime the video and speed it up now I use Final Cut Pro 10 and you can check out my other video where I explain how I do all my videos so all my 4k I'm, I'm exclusively 4k now on Iris Guys Adventure Channel so you can check out my YouTube 4k export video tutorial that's how I take everything out of Final Cut Pro for YouTube upload the advantage to that is that when it's uploaded in 4k that if your viewer has a 4k tv or a 4k monitor they're able to experience it in the full detail but if they don't and they're watching it in 1080p which is high definition or or a lower resolution it's still going to look more clear if it was filmed natively in 4k because it's it's filmed natively and then higher resolution and then it's you know then it's being watched at that resolution or lower so it's a more detailed video and this these are just a few quick pointers i encourage you to ask me uh any questions you may have and actually it's your questions that prompted this video so tell me what you think follow me on Facebook as well facebook.com forward slash irix guy check out 400 or below .com. and I've got a tutorial section all kinds of goodness there you know anything you need just drop me a line I'll try my best to answer I, I enjoy doing this and I'm <laughs> my feet are giving out on me because I'm on rocks and uh, my shoes got wet so yeah, but I had to film this video anyway. And uh, be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. YouTube.com forward slash Irix. Yeah, y'all have a good day.